One other thing to note. <coughs> if we go down here at zero hertz, oops, zero, yeah, zero hertz. So if I start here and I call this zero hertz, and then we go up here, what high is this? 20 kilohertz, okay? This is pretty much the sound range of a human, okay? Uh, it's not really zero hertz, where is it? I don't know where the lowest you can hear is. Like down here is where elephants hear. They like make that rrrr sound. You guys been to the zoo? You go to the zoo, they'll play this thing. Rrr, it'll be like this thumping of the ground. So elephants hear that, we don't hear it. Up here, 20 kilohertz, this is like dog whistle sound. Okay. Normally your voice is actually between 300 and about 3400 hertz. This is voice. Okay. And so what we normally do, you think about the microphone. There's the microphone right here. We actually only take this part of the signal. I'll put that in quotes. Only the voice part is sampled. Okay? They don't sample these really high frequencies because your voice doesn't normally make those sounds. And they don't sample the really low frequencies because your voice doesn't make those sounds either. Like an 808 drum kick. You guys, where's my drum machine programmers in here? That's down here around 30, 40 hertz. You can still feel it like boom. Anyway. You guys out in TV land are getting the same thing because they do the same in TV land. So they probably only do this range. And if I brought a dog whistle, beep, you'd be like, what? I don't hear any of that. All right, so only the voice part is sampled. So you're saying if you have a phone call and you do a really low note or low frequency, you wouldn't hear it? Mm-hmm. It does say bandwidth and we'll just put here bits per second too, okay? The phone company, when, for example, they used to do things in the old days where they'd have to take people's voice phone calls, trans basically transpose your phone call to a radio frequency. And so they'd have to have different radio channels for each person's phone calls. You guys can see where that would happen, right? Like on the radio station, you have different stations. So if they want to carry multiple phone calls on a little microwave dish, that's what they would do. And they needed to be sure of what frequency range they use for each person. And so they did that. So they only sample certain amounts of it. Okay? I note that because this has to do with some of our other signaling techniques. And I will just note for example. If you only use certain ranges, it means you can use the remaining for other uses, we'll just say. You guys ever heard of DSL? So DSL uses the same phone line that you would normally use for a telephone call, but it sends data over that line. So what that means is DSL, it reserves the 0 to 3.4K is for the voice. And then starting up here, it starts at about, uh, what is it? 25 kilohertz, they put data up here, okay? And I used to have DSL, and they actually gave you a little filter. So you had your phone, and you'd plug your phone. If you had your phone plugged into the wall, so we you put your computer here. 
If you had your phone plugged into the same place as your computer, you'd hear this high pitch scream in your phone. So the phone company gave you a little filter that you put on your phone that it would only allow these voice ranges through. Isn't that awesome? So DSL, that's why they do things like that with your voice. So that's DSL. For cable, it's the same kind of thing. They want to be able to carry voice. They need to carry TV signals. And they need to be able to carry um, data. Okay, So they do basically the same things. They sample your voice just like normal. I think that, uh, actually, I don't know for sure. I would assume the cable company digitizes your voice and mixes it in with your data. And if you're on a digital TV signal, it's all going to be mixed together. But if you still get analog TV, you do. You s there's still analog TV signals that use certain parts of their bandwidth. Right. So we're good with this. We like the digitizing. We like the sampling of limited ranges.